Hello everyone, I hope you're doing well. My name is Alina and currently you are watching my illustration channel. Yes, I'm not sure exactly what will happen to this channel because I'm new here, I do not know exactly what to do with it, but I'm gonna try to learn just by doing and we're gonna see what's gonna happen in the future. I'm gonna start today's episode by telling you that I am starting a new series or at least a series on this channel because I had created a series before but not in video mode. So yeah, this is my first series on this channel and it's gonna be related to serial killer portraits and uh, creating them using ink liners. I must tell you that ink liners are my favorite instrument to use when I'm drawing because um, I find it really relaxing to create all those dots and you're gonna see uh, creating uh, the shadows with, with dots is something extremely relaxing for me. I think I like detailed stuff and um, I think I'm, I'm having somehow the same, uh, let's call it problem with illustration, uh, which is digital, creating a lot of details sometimes and yeah, I do it for my brain because it makes me feel it makes me feel all right. So yeah, I must tell you that I did not uh, start the series with this uh, portrait you see right here of Richard Ramirez because, um, well, the first one didn't come out so great. So I I thought that I'm gonna start with the second one and redo the first one. That's exactly what I did. You're gonna see Ted Bundy, the better version in a future episode, and. Um, also, what can I tell you about the idea behind it? Well, the idea popped inside my brain when I had a conversation with someone on Facebook. Um, someone who watched a video I made on my other booktube channel about, about the movie, my friend uh, Dahmer. You know, Jeffrey Dahmer, the serial killer and cannibal and whatever. And after that discussion, I thought, well, why not make a series to to sell on Redbubble because I'm new at that also and I want to create more consistent content and something that I would also wear and use. So um, yeah, after talking with that person, I, I thought that there must be some other people who are interested or just fascinated in a weird way, fascinated by uh, the minds of serial killers. I would be really curious to see what's inside, uh, not physically, but uh, at the thought level. What's inside their brain? How they are thinking? Why are they doing what they're doing? And all the other things. So yeah, that's, that's how the idea came to me. And um, there were other reasons behind me creating this series. First of all, I wanted to practice my um, drawing skills and draw constantly and on a, day, on a daily basis. Also, I wanted to practice the um, facial features because I've, I've noticed that I'm not so great at creating a portrait of someone and being a perfect copy of that person's face. So I wanted to, to improve that and to try to create recognizable uh, faces. And the last reason was that uh, red bubble thing, because I really want to improve that and to, to, to see how it goes. I've seen many people, many artists creating art and putting it on that uh, website. And I really wanted to see how it works, if it works and how it goes. I don't know if it's interesting to you. Maybe I'm going to make another episode about that and how I started. But right now I'm really at the beginning and when I'm going to have more experience with it, I'm sure I'm going to be able to tell you more details. Anyway, this is the series. This is the first drawing in the series. I hope you're liking this. I hope I'm inspiring you to create your own series. Uh, I do plan to, to start another after I finish this one. I'm not sure exactly how many portraits this will have, but I'm sure there are going to be a little more than five. So stay tuned because I'm going to post uh, each and every one of them in here and you're going to see exactly how it was created. If you have any tips for me or if you just want to say hi, I am expecting you in the comment section. We can, let's call it, see each other there, talk about whatever you, you want to talk about. And um, don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed it, subscribe if you want to stay um, with me and see what other videos and what other content I'm going to uh, put on this channel. And uh, till next time, I hope you're gonna have some sunny and wonderful days and we're gonna see each other soon. Bye!